Hey, you guys, welcome back. It's Plan With Me Day, and we're going to get down and play with some of the new transient goodies. So let's jump in. Okay, I'm going to be using this kit from Lux Book. This is her Chasing Dreams kit. Um, Lux Book stuff, I don't think I've ever bought a kit from her that I have not loved. So that's exciting. And then we just have this blank um, canvas here, which in last week's plan with me, I showed you how to easily make square templates for your planners if you were interested in doing them. So let's do, let's change it up a little bit. We're going to use our square template, but we're going to use a standard um, style planner on it. Let's see. I think I have it. That's a dark one. Here we go. We'll use this purple one. Now, I'm going to make this larger sized while I work on the planner itself, and then we'll shrink it down to make it into a desktop. So these kits come with like a lot of like little splashes and things like that, which I really like for um, like desktop style planning. And then it has a lot of these like papers. Now, I don't know. Yeah, see these, they're not necessarily movable, but... I'm going to go ahead and hit export this page. And then I'm just going to copy this because this is all one page. Like there's no white space here. So then I could come back here, long press and paste it. And then we'll have like that paper style here. So actually I'm going to do one page and then I'm going to paste it again to try to fill this entire page. We'll see how this looks. Okay, that's not bad. That actually worked out. And then we'll go back over here and grab some more decor. Maybe these dot things here. Normally when I do my dailies, um, I do more of like a check mark style I guess like these are the things that I did and I'm going to add a couple of those but I wanted to do a little more of a like decorative one today and if you can hear all that banging in the background I am sorry it is my husband and my children <laughs> let's see so I'm just kind of laying down like a bunch of layers. There we go. Oh, that's cute. And then let's see what photos I have on here. Here's one of the boys on one of our walks this week. We can stick that there. And then I have some of those um, like scrapbooking squares. Where are those? Here they are. And I like to use these on pictures because they remind me of when my grandmother used to literally do like putting photos into photo albums before photo albums were like the clear piece. So those are always fun. Okay. So now on the other side, I want to do a little more of a light look. So I think I'm going to grab this thing. And then maybe I'll I don't want to dupe it exactly because I don't want it to look like it's a pattern so I'll just flip one around like that and then maybe we'll ooh, do some black boxes today I'm trying to be mindful too because I'm going to put a coil on here or we can grab some of the pink punch discs. Maybe I'll do that. There 
There we go. And then today is podcast day. So we can put this down here. Actually, we can put this over here and add to our layered look. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna change my text to white because we're drawing on the black. There we go. There were zero spaces in there at all. Did you see that? <laughs> That's supposed to be miles. I wrote spaces. That's fantastic. Oh my gosh. And then since we have school coming up soon, um, can I fit computers? Yeah. I need to uh, dig out the kids' school computers and make sure that everything's updated and ready to go before school starts. I ain't ready for it, but that don't mean it's not coming. Okay, so now we'll grab a little more of these little deco pieces. Let's see. I think she will actually fit perfectly down here. There we go. Oh, that's cute. Okay. And I don't know if um, those things were necessarily my goals. Maybe we'll use the discipline one. Oh, there we go. Okay. So for these, um, you can even use the uh, August Extreme Planner um, rings, which are in here some dang where. Oh, here we go. Like, you could put these in here? Oh. Well, that just looks like it was made for it, doesn't it? I think that's what we're going to go with. Okay, so now that I have the um, planner part set up, we can select all of it, resize, and make it into like an actual spread. So we'll head into... Oh... Well, that's convenient. There's some plants already here from a spread that I did earlier. Gonna need some, like, fall plants soon. There we go. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so back to where I was originally going. Maybe we'll do this one. Yeah. Okay, so I'm making this really tiny so that I can select all of these and paste them here because, as we know, GoodNotes doesn't like to layer. So now this is on the bottom and I can make it as big as I want to and other stuff's still going to sit on top of it, which looks good. So now let's grab a pen. What does this one say? Fiction addiction. There we go. And then maybe the camera from Rose stuff. There we go. Oh, that's cute. So there we go. That's how I typically will use the zip binders. Um, oh, I just realized that this one is off of the edge, which is going to kind of be a pain to fix, but oh, not too bad. There we go. Adorable. So yeah, that's typically how I will use these. Um, and it's honestly sort of how I use the, uh, the square ones too, except I don't typically like diagonal you know like crank the square ones over for some reason with the square ones it just doesn't look right to me but with the like the tall hobonichi style ones it's super cute so yeah i think that is gonna be it for this one um i'm uh not gonna lie i'm pretty pretty exhausted it's been a week 
let me tell you, it has been a week. So I'm going to go ahead and close out this video and get back to work on all the stuff that I did not do this week. <laughs> so as always, you guys, thank you for watching. If you have any um, uh, requests for how to's for any of the transients, don't hesitate to um, send me a message and you know, I'll get those filmed for you guys. And as a side note, I do want to say a huge shout out to my Patreons. Uh, thank you guys so much for your continued support. Um, our Patreon live stream is coming up this weekend as of the recording of this video. So uh, don't want to miss that. So thanks again for watching you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.